Hey boys and girls, like we said yesterday, teen numbers are so special, we want to spend a little bit of time talking about each one. So yesterday we talked about 11, 12, and 13. If you didn't have a chance to watch that, you may want to start there. Today we're going to think about the numbers 14, 15, and 16. All of them are teen numbers. So go ahead and get your material, same as yesterday, all about the teen number, plastic sleeve, and whiteboard materials. Press pause and then come on back and hit play when you're ready. Okay, so today we're gonna to start with the number 14. So our first job is to practice writing the number 14, making sure that we're forming our digits the right way. So with the number one, we always start at the skyline and go down to the grass line. And then for the number four, we start at the skyline, go down to the plane line, fly across the plane line, back up to the skyline, and straight down to the grass line. The poem for four is down, over, down some more. That's the way you make a four. Go ahead and make the number 14 a few times. I probably have room for maybe four more. Each time making sure your digits are nice and neat as you're working. If you want to pause to erase or fix one, that would be a great idea if that's something you wanna do. Okay, just like yesterday, we're gonna go first to our double 10 frame to show the number 14. Seeing it in a 10 frame just really helps make the rest of this make sense. So like all T numbers, 14 has a full group of 10. So we start by filling in our first 10 frame. Fill it in all the way. Then we're gonna count on and fill in some more ones in the second 10 frame. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And now we can fill in the other parts of our sheet to tell more and to show the number 14 in different ways. We showed 14 in a double 10 frame and now we can show 14 in a number sentence. 10, that's this 10 frame, plus four more equals 14. 10 plus four equals 14. And we can also show 14 in a chart like this. 14 has one 10, and four ones. This is the tens place and this is the ones place. In any number that we have, this digit will tell us how many tens there are and this digit will tell us how many ones there are. Okay, now let's show 14 using our number bond. 14 is our total. We have a group of 10 and we have four more ones. Great job practicing the number 14 now we're going to go on to the number 15. Can you erase? And for 15, you may find that it takes a little bit longer to write the number because five is a pretty tricky digit to make. Okay, so let's take our time and really make our fives the way that we practice in school using the lines to help us. So of course we start with a one, straight line down and then you're done. That's the way you make a one. And next we go on to our five down and around, and then you stop. You finish a five with a line on top. Sometimes it's helpful to hear um, the lines while we're making our number five. So I'm gonna make a number one, and this time I'll say each of the lines that I'm using. So I start at the skyline, I go down to the plane line, and then around to the grass line, fly across the skyline. Okay, let's try to make a couple more 15s. Remember, if you're still having a bit of a tricky time with that digit five, then you may wanna pause the video and practice really taking your time to make the number 15. Five is a tricky one. Five is also a culprit of being backwards sometimes. So really take your time and make sure you did your very best writing the number 15. Let's go on now to filling in our double 10 frame. Like all team numbers, 15 has a full group of 10. So let's fill in that first 10 frame. Okay, so we have 10, and now we'll count on to add some more ones. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We have 10, full 10 frame, plus, five more ones. So 10 plus five 
equals 15. Next, let's go on to our chart. In the number 15, we have 110. That's our first 10 frame up here, a whole group of 10. And five more ones. 110, five ones. Last, let's go to our number bond. 15 is our total. And our parts are going to be 10 and 5. Okay, we practiced 14, we practiced 15. Our last number that we'll practice together today is the number 16. So go ahead and get your board all ready. And let's write our 16 in the top corner. And then actually mine's a little messy, so I'm gonna erase and fix it. My board slid a little bit, there we go. And so now we'll practice writing the number 16. Of course, we start with our one because we have one group of 10. And then we're gonna make our six. A hoop and then a loop. Our six starts at the skyline, curves around to the grass line and curves back in. It does touch the plane line at one point. Take your time making your number six. Make sure it's facing the right direction if you need to pause to erase and fix it, that's something a great mathematician would do to make sure that we can really read your number 16. And when you're ready, we'll go on to the double 10 frame. Like all team numbers, a 10 or a, a 16 has starts with a full group of 10. So here we go. Okay. 10 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So in our 16, we have a group of 10 and six more ones. 10 plus six equals 16. And let's go ahead now and fill in our, our chart. One 10, that's right here, and six more ones. And then last is our number bond. 16 is our total, and our parts that we're showing are a group of 10 and six more ones. Great job today, focusing and thinking about the numbers 14, 15, and 16. If you want, you can go into your math workbook and practice this page. You can think about recycling and taking care of the earth along with thinking about team numbers. You're gonna cut off the numbers at the bottom. Remember, like we practice in school, our recommendation is to cut all the way across and then cut the pieces out. It's a little bit easier. You may need to have a family member help you cut because it seems like it's a little stuck in the notebook. Then you'll use your glue stick to glue each of the team numbers next to the um, picture in the, of the double 10 frames that it matches. We can't wait to see your work. We're so proud of you. Come on back tomorrow and we'll talk about the numbers 17, 18, and 19. Those are the last team numbers. Have a great day.